Welcome back to another video. Today is my once a week series, the So Rare series. Let's get right into it. So Rare to Glory, to be exact. The name series. Let's get right into it. I want to look at how my soccer lineups did and show you. So here's the order it's going to be how my soccer lineups did, my rewards, how my current how my lineups for next week will look, how my basketball lineup did. And what my lineup for next week is. So let's get right into it. Robert Sanchez gave up two goals, 54 points. I wasn't expecting a lot out of him when I, when I said that. But 54 after giving up points is still all right. Van Dyke, I was not expecting to give up three goals. It's 12 points right there that they lost. Gross came as a sub. I wasn't expecting that. Hanky Chan, I was expecting much out of. Sun, 73 points. Did have an own goal, so like he really should have had like 90. This lineup I just submitted in just for points. Law Foster having mental health issues. I'm not gonna say anything about it. It happens. Can't be mad at it. This lineup did horrible. All of them. He gave up a goal. Natan gave up three. Ederson just did nothing. Plus, team to give up three goals. Yeah, Xerxes, I'm guessing came on as a sub. That yeah, lineup did really bad. This lineup, better. My goalie, first game of the week, gets me a solid 86. Thinking, okay, maybe I'll do good. Rico, does horrible. Gives up two goals. Frederico did nothing. Orzabal did nothing. Griezmann did nothing. French League... We did better. I mean, only 311 points. You need like about like 400 to get a reward. Well, we did good though. 41. Junior Ito, 42. No. Ben Yadder had a goal, which comes with points. Pierre Le Malou got 68, pretty good. Bradley Laco had a clean sheet, but yeah, got 10 points for that, but he didn't do much. This Bundesliga lineup. All I'm going to say is their game got cancelled. So that kind of ruined it. So if you can tell, no rewards. But I'll show you game week 431 because I missed out on 430. Because I didn't know Prem was coming up so quick. So the weekday games are going to have no games in it. Like, I don't have a lineup. But I do like my lineups for this week. Robert Sanchez against Everton. I think he can easily get a clean sheet. That's so, like, look at this game. Kept a clean sheet. They have a bunch of saves. Or, like, I think you get a clean sheet. Can easily give me some points. Van Dyke, Crystal Palace. I don't think Crystal Palace is that good. Can I find when he last played Crystal Palace? I want to see when's the last time he played Crystal Palace. How did it go? 69 points. With a clean sheet. So, he can get points. Pascal Gross. He gets a lot of goals or assists. He had 12 matches, 3 assists, 2 goals. If he just gets a goal or assist, we're good. Hung Min Sun. Same thing as about Gross. He just scores a lot. If he gets a goal, he's going to score well. Rashford. I don't know how I feel about this. Let me look. When he gets on the sheet, he does good. When he doesn't, he does not do good. Like, he doesn't get a lot of points off the ball. Like, not goal points. Which I'm pretty sure Lyle Foster won't play again, so... We're just chalking that lineup up. We're going to keep Barisha, see how he does. Teo Hernandez, I really like. Playing against Atalanta will be hard, but... We'll see how it goes. Because, look, he scores high. Because he likes getting on the, on the sh score sheet. Getting goals, assists, or just scores high. Yeah. Louis Alberto can do good. Vechka for Cacciatella can always do good. Xerxes. I mean, he's been banging a lot of goals recently, so we'll see. We're going to leave Valles because he played really good last game. We're going to keep Federico. Hope he does well. Rudiger has been stepping up because when I first got him, he was 40. It was really cheap. I'm like, he's going to improve because his last 15, he's now worth 55. I've saved. 15 points per week. And now look. 
Because this was beginning of the season right around here. Let me find it. I think from right here, I want to say, is the beginning. Like, he had this really bad slump. It was just horrible. So I got him real cheap. Griezmann can do well. Aspas can do well. French League, I don't play this thing exactly. Because I don't really know another French League, unfortunately. I like my Bundesliga lineup. Finn Dalmen. If he puts up a clean sheet, he. Oh, he had a penalty save. He even keep a clean sheet. Okay, he did have 10 saves. Yeah, penalty save. 8 saves. Like, he's getting a lot of saves. So we'll see how he does. Schlotterbeck can always do well. But it just depends. Javi Simons, I really like. But I'm going for Harry Kane on captain. Because he's been scoring like a beast. I mean, look at that. He's averaging 71 points over his last 15 games. And then Conrad Lymar, who's been surprisingly good recently. If you look at his last three, he's averaging the 60s. So that's the soccer part. Let's get into the NBA. My lineups. Uh, how many? I think we missed two of them. All right, this one did really bad. Randall at sixty, Sor Thomas thirty-two, Tatum thirty-one, Harrison Barnes twenty-six, which was good. Coro eighteen, so whatever. And this week, Tim Hardaway did not play. Tatum got me thirty-one. It's okay. Backley seven, Claxton eighteen, Randall forty-six. But this week. Harrison Barnes only got me 14, which is not good at all. Like, he only scored four points. He got a block and a steal. Like, he didn't do much. Rajon Bochan, I'm not expecting a lot of points out of. Now, Tatum did really good. 32 points, six assists, one steal. Double double, which is just one point? Really? Oh, okay. With 12 rebounds. Like, Tatum did pretty good. Uh, I didn't get any rewards, in case you're wondering. And my lineups for next week going Tatum, who's got two games against the Cavs. We'll see how he does there. Sore Thompson, Pacers, and Sixers. Both really good teams. Claxton, who's got uh, Kings. Uh, Phoenix, Denver, which these two games are smaller centers, which means more rebounds. So we'll see how Claxton does. Julius Randle, Raptors, Jazz. Jazz have not been good. They're my favorite team, but they just haven't been good, so we'll see. Desmond Jr., I'm hoping, just pops off and has a good game. Like, that's all I really got to say. But, if you guys do... If you have any interest in joining, oh, oh, hold up. let me restart that. So, with so rare, these, this is like your first time watching. You have no idea what it's about. These competitions that I'm in, if they do well, like if they do well, finish top 150, I get rewards, like a limited tier two. Let's say I get Declan Rice. Somehow finish really good. Get Declan Rice. I can. I want to see his lowest buy now. Sixty-one dollars right there. One sixty-one dollars for. Actually, it would be a newer one. So, ninety-three dollars. Ninety-three dollars right there. If I finish top, whatever. And it's a free game, completely free. Just go into any browser, just type in so rare, sign up, whatever. But there's also a market where you can buy and sell the players I was telling you about. And if you buy, if you use my code in the description, I'll put it in there. And if you buy five players from the auctions within 30 days of signing up using my code, me and you both will get uh, one rare player, one random rare player, which could go anywhere from $1 up to 1000 So, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you can to help out. I'll see you next time.